Hello chat, what's up there? Today in this video I'm going to be telling you guys about what I got to on my Wednesday. It's the middle of the week so you guys know what that means. We have two more days until it is the weekend. Today I got ready for the day ahead and I was up nice and early. I had a nice fresh shower and that helped wake me up and I had some breakfast and we had the people coming in to sort out the gutters to so do out in the back garden sorting the gutters out and my dad was at work. So is my younger sister and brother and my old brother and myself got ourselves ready as we were going off to help my dad do some work at his school where he caretakes for. And I said goodbye to my mum, who was still asleep and just made sure that she was alright. Said goodbye to Harves and then I got myself ready and me and my old brother went off to where my dad caretakes for at the school he works at. And me and my old brother were doing some painting of these fences around the flower beds that they had put in so we had to paint those and but gloss them over and we had to put these gloves on which i still can smell the gloves on my hands now and i hate the smell and i've washed my hands about 50 times and i just still can't get the smell off my hand and so we did that and then went off and got our lunch from the corner shop and went off to my dad's poor cabin like outhouse kind of thing where his office is and had our lunch and just before that we'd been chopping down some trees that and like stuff from the flower beds that we didn't need anymore and put those at the back of the field in like a corner of the fire where it's quite overgrown so none of the children could go and table and just sticks or anything so it was nice and put away safely so no kids could hurt themselves on any of the sticks or branches and then we had a lunch and I treated and I had a break before lunch just a bit early on and I called up my mate as we were supposed to be hanging out but he was busy and so was I so of course we've rearranged and then called him and just said how my day was going and then after we'd had our lunch we were then sorting out the fences around the flower beds some more doing some more painting and glossing of that then i went off and helped one of the teachers sort out some display work and was tall enough to reach and just put some staples in for them so i could get on the chair i'm very clumsy anyway so i thought i was going to fall over but luckily i didn't fall off the chair so i helped her with that and then we were just having a good chit chat because I was saying how my old sister used to work at this school where my dad care takes for. So we were just talking about that for a while. My hair was so crazy. I've just got a cat, so I'm just a bit on the fence on if I like it or not. So it's just really bugging me at the moment, but it'll grow back. Hopefully, I have a cat in the family to go bold. I know I'm going bold when I'm older, but not yet not today season and yeah she's really lovely and we had a nice chat got to know one another and i know quite a few of the other teachers because my dad caretakes and my old sister used to work there so it was nice seeing some old faces i haven't seen in ages and i also met this new guy that started teaching there so i was just having a good chat with him and then we finished off painting the fences around the flower beds that had been put in and my dad was sorting them out, putting the flowers and stuff in. And then we swept up and sorted out the bins and put all the leaves and sticks and twigs and stuff from the flower beds that we'd sorted out into the bins to take to the tip to put the stuff in to the tip and had a wheelbarrow to put the stuff in as well. And my older brother hit me with one of the gloves on my cheek and also hit me with the handle of the hammer which hurt and he said oh it doesn't hurt that much I did it to himself and thought oh actually it did what a numbskull got and he was just winding up calling me names and just being a bit of a butt munch oh do was eh what you can what are you going to do with them and he was saying that he does more stuff around the house than i do like cleaning up the kitchen and stuff which is not true i barely see him left the finger i do most of the stuff around the house i'm always tidying out i've got ocd so it's 
good for me. I just tidy up anyway. And so I'm always tidy up and stuff. And it really annoys me when he says stuff like that. And on the way in, we listened to Paolo Nuccini. And I love this singer. I think it's got, I got his name right. My older brother was trying to drill it into my because I kept on saying it wrong. And it was last question of my favourite songs of his. And we listened to it on the way in. And just as we got to my dad's work, where, school where he TEDx for, we had to turn it off. So, of course, on the way home, we were trying to, I was trying to listen to it. And he turned off and put Cardi B on, which I can't, I just can't stand Cardi B. And he blasted out full blast, and it was so annoying. And we were having so much fun, we were blasting out Grease 2 and the Great Showman and stuff, and he, we were get, getting on really well. And then he went and said that I always kick off if I don't get my way, which is not true. And he faced time to my older sister and asked who she thinks does more on the house. And she purposely said Luke just to wind me up, which is not true. My older brother does not do more to wind the house than me, I do more than him. And of course, on the way home, we got KFC for a treat. Got back home, and the people sorting out the gutters had broken our like green bin we have that's a, like, a little like bin where we put like pea stuff and bags and stuff and stuff to play out in the garden. Yeah. So, of course, if it had rained, it would have got soaking wet. And they went over the flat with and over the side, so they didn't have to walk through the house because they didn't want to get in trouble, which is annoying and they shouldn't have done that and they should have told us that they'd broken that thing but luckily my, my dad bodging it managed to sort it out and so it's all good but it's still annoying how they didn't tell us that they'd broken it until my mum went outside and saw it had been broken and I got back and we had our KFC, my dad got back from work as well, we left a bit earlier than he did and he got back and had his KFC, my older brother is off out and my younger brother got back from work for his lunch break and he had his KFC, then he went off back to work and my younger sister got back from work but she's not having tea, she's gone out with her mates and my older sister has well been training tonight and my old brother has gone down to see her there and help with training and he had a interview today for a job so he was on the phone well on his well, on our lunch break about that and I went onto my Facebook Twitter and Instagram read him drew and I played with my own pizza doll and got my pizza dolls out for me to sort out tomorrow and I am going to be working on the new structures on my book tomorrow and doing a lot of writing as I went on a massive walk the other day and got a load of good ideas and started brainstorming for some new ideas for my book and I can't wait to start writing and when I start going I'm like a writing machine I just absolutely love writing and I watched Henry and Neighbours and watched some Supernatural and Dot 2 and Stitches episodes and watched some episodes of Will and Grace Pose and absolutely love Pose, this Fox TV show starring Ellen Peters, it's so good. And I watched some episodes of RuPaul's Dark Race, America's Next Model, and Project One Way, and watched some episodes of British Bake Off, Cake Boss, and some other cooking show stuff. And I had a ice cream for my pudding, and I then read some Vogue and Hello magazines and some Doctor comics, worked on my book a bit, getting it ready for when I start doing some more writing for it tomorrow and I've left it on a really good cliffhanger so I cannot wait to continue writing tomorrow and I worked on some new songs, played on my keyboard a bit and watched some episodes of Zoe 101, such a classic TV show, haven't watched it in such a long time and I watched some episodes of Tortured and some other sci-fi and fantasy stuff. Absolutely love sci-fi and fantasy. And I played with my main Pluto doll and did some dozen dollhouse photography and Pluto doll photography and watched Hobby from yesterday and also watched some episodes of The Bill and some other piece 
and crime investigation stuff and watch some episodes of Miss Marple, Midsummer Murders and Murder Show and some other murder mystery shows and I watch 60 Minute Makeover, Terror SOS and Grand Designs at the Sketch Country and some house buying, house makeover and building and garden makeover shows and watch this treehouse making competition show and it was so awesome I'd love to have my own treehouse and I then watched some dollhouse tour videos dollhouse tour videos and it's just a dollhouse and dollhouse stuff off every Amazon and Smith and watch some dollcraft videos and I am now off to go watch this evening suits write my journal and then start playing playing with and sorting out my brief at dolls and do some more brief at doll photography I'm working on subscriptions for this for my doll guitar show and so on other sets and pops of that. I hope you guys have all had a lovely week so far or have a lovely rest of your week and I shall see you soon with new blog coming very soon. Bye!